Y254. Imagine. <laughs> Thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. My name is Cheryl Blessing and you are watching The Power Talk Show. Before we went on our break, we were having a conversation on what does it take to maintain your adult friendships. Mm. We want to understand how can you maintain your friendship through the busy schedules, at a same corner long distance friendships. Mm -hmm. How are you maintaining that? How do you know if your friend is real? I'm a near fake friend. Go on our social media platforms and write your comments. Nendiki opinion yako. Kama ukona anything kutuliza, apa tukona experts. Tuliza na tutakuambia sasa. Tutakujibu maswali yako yote. So we've touched on a few things. We've touched on how to form friendships, how to start, how to tell friends apart. Unawa separate aje. And then before we went on the break, we were talking about people who, baby watakuzwa kulize for help. And when you can't, they start being okay. haters. Mm. So there's also the aspect of friends who turn into haters, which we'll touch on. But Beryl was just sharing something important. She was talking about the uh, friendship. Because so many of us are sentimental. Uko like, eh, tumetoka na uu mbali. Tulikuwa na diapers na uyu. Kutoka primary, siju ni mejuana na yeye. But you've outgrown the friendship. So how do you let go? So Beryl, just share what you were telling us. And then maybe we can get it from the expert to be how we can deal with that. Okay. Um, I think uh, basically when I started to realize there's a problem, <coughs> when, I, when I got pregnant with my girl, um, what will you put here? What will, yeah, like people, you remember when you tell your friends, guys, I'm pregnant, like, yay, we will be there for you, we will stand with you, we will work with you, and then I'll vanish. I was like, where? And then when I came back, uh, okay, to myself, I used to tell myself, I have a problem with letting go. Mm. I think that is one of my weaknesses. Kwa chile atu kitu, mina kwa nga mtu, yani, nasema nga nime invest manze, lazima tu nishikilie. So, I think I used to be like, no. Maybe, maybe, they kwa na credit ya kunipigia. Maybe they didn't have the time because now to me grow, now people are working, those some are working on their careers. So, I used to have that problem because everybody, I feel like uh, my squad vanished. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. To a point where by someone realizes and adi anakuambia, ah, unajua unanga marafiki, walienda. Mm. So, you know, when it came to that, when I came back from where I was, I was like, where did these people go? So, I started looking, nilianza, mimi mwenyewe personally, nilianza kwa tafta, amwezi enda maali. But mm. I've been through thick and thin. You know, at, at, at that point, I used to feel like through thick and thin was zile mashere, mm. labda yeah. ulipewa heartbreak, I was there. Mm. <laughs> eh? Labda <laughs> mzazi ya mekwa 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 So I used to feel like those were the through thick and thin they too. So like, I know I'm not the only person struggling with this, but kwa chilia friendship, me kwa chilia anything. Mm. I feel like anything ni meanza kwa chilia, ni... It's a bit tricky. Yeah, it's both the positive and negative, but... Antony, how do we let go of friendship? Yeah. <laughs> because yeah, because oh. I'm pretty sure she's not okay. the only one. Yeah. So many people are very sentimental. Una actually had your friendships and you've really outgrown it. I'm a usha realize unim to fake. How do you let go? Number one, uh, one thing you have to realize, ule mtu mwenye hawezi ko let go, or maybe you have been having friends na wakahepa, na you feel like hapana, hawa ni watu maybe you may invest, and maybe you even take a step forward, unaadi wa unatafuta. Number one, this person is uh, experiencing loss. Number two, they're in denial. And number three, they need to be ready to grow. And one thing about friendship, we always, we always have to, to grow with some friends. Marafiki wengine tulianza nao kitambo ya manishi, tutakuwa. I remember, the, let me use a good example. I remember uh, I used to have a friend uh, back in the days, uh, 2018 na uko. And this friend of mine, akakuja, aka boom, aka pata pesa, aka pata fame, aka kuja tuwa poenta kuko juu kabisa. Mm -hmm. Now that friend, uh, few was uh, like after like two years later, ama three years, mm -hmm. nikam I texted them. Akaniambia, tukaongea kidogo, salamu, then akaniambia, kamuliza what happened, what what happened to our friendship before. Kaniambia, um, Anthony, let me ask you a good question. If you used to work in a bank, mm -hmm. oh no, if you used to work in an Mpesa, and you get promoted to work in a bank, will you still keep the friendship, you, the friends you had in your Mpesa? workplace. 
it depends. <laughs> yeah, you might, but you know, yeah. this now is an, is an environment, another environment you're in. It's yeah. a bank area, so meaning you have to be ready to make new friends there. True. You know, you don't live in denial of the friends you had. Mm. So I think the, the, the only solution to that is number one, ha learning how to accept. Okay. And learning how to accept is now the hardest part of it. Eh? True. Yeah. But one way or another, you have to just uh, learn to, and time, time heals things. The same same thing with stages of loss. Uh, there is denial, there is anger, there is bargaining, there is depression, there is acceptance. Most people have to go through all that. It's the same, your loss, they come at two loss, yeah, any kind or any other kind of loss. Okay. So the first step of it is denial. So maybe you not being able to let go is maybe because you're in denial that this is a, these, are these friends were there with me na, na tulikuwa tu na ka, 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 ka relationship kazuri. Na walienda aje, what really happened? Mm -hmm. So you're in denial, you're not ready to accept what happened. Mm -hmm. The other thing, maybe you feel uh, unajika sirikia, ama unajika sirikia. And the other thing you bargain, bargaining com ha comes in, I'm talking now about the stages of loss. Mm -hmm. Bargaining now comes in in terms of now you bargain either with God, unauliza mungu, nili wakosea haji. Si unilatea hata moja, at least, na ukinilatea moja, nita make sure nita keep your relationship, ama your friendship, niko nayo. And depression comes in where by now you feel stressed, you are sad, you emo you're emotional, you know, so you even lack sleep, you mm -hmm. lack appetite, and now the last stage is acceptance. So, one thing you need to just realize is you're in denial, and once you know you're in denial, now work towards Accepting. Accepting slowly. Yeah. And I think maybe we can also highlight mm -hmm. when you've outgrown. Yes. Because mm -hmm. labda, oh, I'm pesa pia and I grew at the same pace as you. Because <laughs> yeah. there are people who <laughs> are not growing at the same pace as you. Yeah. And kama uyo to seme, mm. labda mifika hapo alafu maturity yake, mindset, mm. his perspective of things has changed. Mm. They've shifted. And maybe timeline equal different because mm -hmm. you know we need to also understand that so if the timeline is different mm -hmm. accept exactly go through the the mm -hmm. process of grief yeah. but then accept and move so very low says it to me to me accept na maisha imesonga tuko hapo tuko hapo because now because of that mm -hmm. we have the aspect of people who become haters mm -hmm. friends who probably you got to a point and you realized i've really outgrown the situation i'm yeah. uko na mtu ni toxic because there are those people who Genuinely, you know, this is not my genuine friend. Uyuni yeah. ako fake. Behind my back, they'd stab me immediately. Mm. Then they turn to haters because you left them. They feel like, Uya liniacha tu, alafu, they keep stalking you. They, you know, they throw shade because they feel like they used to know you. Mm. And they're holding on to that idea mm. of who you are. Yeah. Beryl, have you experienced that from people who maybe ulikuwa ma marafiki na ukitambo? Alafu, they thought sasa maisha ime, ime kuhambul. Then God akasema, no, this is still my girl. So people who became haters because your friendship ended, have you experienced that personally? I've not had it direct, but I feel like I've, 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 I know it. Yeah? One thing about me, I feel like I know it. But I take with a direct push. I don't know, is it because of uh, my attitude or just my personality? Someone feels like I'm, very, I'm, a, I'm a very approachable person. But when it comes to some things, direct, I will tell you no. So I feel like I've, I've had it, but I was not the statements. No, the not showing at so you pick it whether you like it. I was like, I feel like there's a statement that really hit me at some point. So when I joined uh, campus, mm -hmm. there's this statement that used to go around. Oh, Tango join university. Oh, Tango join campus. Tango join campus. Then I came, I became pregnant, and they're like, oh, so you ready to? Only ready to area. Eh, we go and then you try and and then I've gone back and they're like, oh, Tango Rudi Campus. So I feel like there's, there's that hater that comes with, with uh, when you get to some point in life. And whatever Anthony has talked about, I think most of us don't understand that it reaches a point that you have to grow. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because yeah, when I go to campus, I'll have to get new friends. Mm -hmm. When I was in campus the first time, the same mm -hmm. friends that I had there then, and now they're totally different. Yeah. So we get to meet new people daily, yes. but now that is the problem with, just the same as you said, acceptance. Kukubalitu mtu wali outgrow, pia na kwa shida. Because I'm like, ah, skuzi na jirinka. Oh no, tangu pate job, tangu nini? Yeah. Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> and this I'm addressing those, I have, I've had a lot of friends who have really had issues with hate, kwanza on social media. Yeah, yeah. You have been friends with someone, na wame wana ume grow. Sasa wana hit on mm. based on where your your level has reached. Unakwambia umeanza maringo. Jutu hauku ona message yao on time will reply <laughs> late. Ti sasa umeanza kuringa. Na maybe uko too busy. Yeah. Umechoka. Sikuzi yeah. uko busy sana. Eh, mm -hmm. sasa una time yetu. So let me tell you something uh -huh. about hate. Okay. And I just, I, let me just repeat as I add kidogo what I just say uh, or what I'm supposed to say. 
Because don't ever dwell on the haters. Let me tell you one thing about haters. Whether you do good, they will always hate. And whether you do bad, they will, at the end of the day, their work is to hate. I think they are fully employed, full-time employees of hate. Yeah. And whether, don't, don't ever care about them. Mm -hmm. The way I said it, focus on those you love or people who love you. Those who love you are those who bring you that positive or that good or good energy. Don't focus on those who hate on you. Because the moment you focus on those who hate on you, you will lose even these people who love you. So you see why focus on my haters, haters what I, what I hate. Whether you do this, whether you do right, whether you do good, whether you do what and what, they will always hate. Awa siwe kusumbua. Ati sasa unakata kungara, ama unakata kufanya kenyu unafanya kwa sababu ya maheta. Wataongea, wea fanya. Waki hate ni shauri yao. Mm. Wenye wanakupenda, wanajua, wanakujua, yeah. mali umetoka, na wata support. Mm. Yes. And that's very important. Yeah. Because unajua sangine, people fixate on that as opposed to the love. Mm. A hundred people can compliment you. Yeah. Mtu moja seme na unakaji you fixate on that. Mm. So we really need to change our mindset. Focus on the love as opposed to the hate. Yeah. Because honestly, if you don't have the haters, then you're doing something wrong. They say that. If yeah. you don't mm. have enemies, if you don't have people who are competing against you, mm. you're doing something wrong. So I just want to pull up the comments. Timothy, <coughs> if those are ready, don't you want what you're saying. Thank you so much. This is Facebook, so let me read some of them. Outsiders says, Nowadays, ni had mm. kuwa tofautisha. Unless shida, ikutuange mm. proper, ndi utajua the true one. Mm -hmm. And that's also a very important perspective because we're trying to find out who is a f true friend and who is a fake friend. Stone Cold Ken Otis says, Sherry, looking fine. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <I can't laughs> Anyone that you don't know online, personally like me, is a fake friend. But when you meet me and know what I am about, then that we become true that friends. Is very true. It's that simple regarding this topic. That That's also true. true. Because so many people form friendships online. Now, how are you to personally? I'll be Katoliki Salano says, Vihiga Mago Center tuned in. Thank you so much for watching us. We have Ale Kings Jeshi says, A true friend is, is, uh, you, is there. Is they usually help when one is in a certain problem, but a fake one is causing problems always. Mm. That's mm. true. A true friend will be there to help you always. Mtum fake ataleta mashida. Crystal Lionel says, Gidurai 44 locked. Thank you so much. Glenn B Blim says, watching. Thank you for watching us. Frederick Kiruri Ndengwa says, you don't differentiate. But how don't you differentiate, Frederick? Utajua jikuz saseta kwa kila mtu. Deno and Sururu says, a true friend is just a person who cares about you and will be with you at any time, be it time of sorrow or happiness. Mm. But just fake friends is the kind of a uh, thing like a parasite uh, who is only attract, attract, attracted is. to your property mm. or belong. Mm. That's true. That and that true. sums up what Anthony was saying to yeah. begin with. GTKE says, live from Bungoma North Vocational Training College. Thank you so much for watching us. Kinyua Ja Apple says, Embu, massive to call locked in. Thank you so much. Uh, Julius Murega says, Pamoja sana. Asante Julius, good to watch. Babi Bahati says, I think in every person we mingle with in uh, any kind of relationship, there's always a red flag. <laughs> it's just your honesty and love for the friendship that makes you ignore. And some people ignore the red flags. Unakuja sure. kushtuka in future. Mm -hmm. uh, China boy says every, everybody appears true until you go <laughs> bro. Very That's true. true. <laughs> I like the comments. Thank you so much for watching us from all over the country. We really appreciate it. I love the comments because we've gotten yeah. we've gotten people who are echoing what we are saying. Yeah. But most people are saying that lazimo kumepitia shida ndio a true friend. Mm -hmm. Which was leading me to the next point of the conversation. Mm -hmm. Do you really have to go through problems or do you have to test your friendships? Is it important for you to test your friendships? Beryl, what would you say right now, after what you've experienced, do you test the friends that you're with? Okay, um, <laughs> testing your friends, it's risky. Are you ready for whatever repercussions that will come about? Mm -hmm. So if you're ready, you know, watch a tune or test. If they're true friends, if it's not, it's bad. You're okay with it, then do it. But if you're not ready, please. <laughs> but I feel I've, I've, I've noticed that topic, uh, something someone has said, um, that you know your f true friends when you go broke or when there's something wrong. And I feel like we have friends who are disguised. Mm -hmm. They're haters, they're just there to pick. 
tunaitanga ze wale followers cyberbullies ama ah leave alone for cyberbullies mm -hmm. kuna tule mtu kwa maisha yako yeye ni angalia tu progress yako imefika wapi paparazzi oh. yeah i want to chat a monitoring spirit squeeze yeah. cctv is <laughs> bad yeah. 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 people are just monitoring your life I, I, i call them cctvs and i feel like uh, whatever one of one of the guys have said online it is very hard kwa jua who is it so i i want anthony to kind of tell us Yeah. How how do you differentiate because the red flags are there true mm -hmm. but we ignore them because i'm like ai hapana labda ni yeah. tu ile tu dem ama ni tu ile the, the human nature si, lazima kweli upitie shida ndo no, ujuu ni rafiki yako cuz the way babi mm -hmm. has said yeah. there's always a red flag mm -hmm. and that's true because everyone kuna hiyo kitu utasema i don't like this about this person mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, you may ignore it because maybe you have more things in common maybe mm -hmm. you share some interests mm -hmm. but your red flag that can lead you to find out that this is a fake person how can you really focus on it because you know sometimes we want to be delusional to say mimi sitaki kujua how do we how do we combat that na lazima to test friendships zetu ndo tujue okay well uh, i think i'll just say this eh? um, i don't think it's necessary for you to test a friend you'll just eventually know who the friend is but the problem is one thing i feel like tuna focusing on the big perspective of now seeing if, whether they are true or not yeah na saa zingine unaweza kuona rafiki yako so for example she is my friend mm -hmm. and i know she is my friend based on cause she's consistent the positivity and i'm vulnerable you know mm -hmm. such kind of things and i ask her yeah, hi beril hi. would you assist me maybe with a uh, thousand bob i'll refund you and you tell me at the yeah. moment i don't have so many say me i koni on rafiki wa ina gani sasa useme sasa wewe ni fake friend ju yeah. honestly i'm saying to hana that is not that is not how you distinguish or say wewe ni fake friend ju amekunyima ama ju amekata haimaanishi ati inaweza kuwa ni genuine hana na ufai ati kushinda ukisema ati hapana huyu amenyima huyu ni fake friend hapana so another thing don't test usif test marafiki zako hakuna haja utajua na utajua aje communication ana communicate aje kama um to say me let me just tell, tell you this a friend is not supposed to communicate every day yeah because that was also i was going to that because <laughs> yeah not every day very mentioned yeah. something like that <laughs> yeah. of kama uja nipigie in a week yeah niko like mbona utapiga but jani ni kuna watu wako busy ama upate mtu mwenye ameshikana kabisa then anaweza kuwa na intention ya kukupigia asahau mm, mm. so hiyo hiyo ndo kitu yenye pia to clarify ye. Is it necessary for them to constantly constantly communication communicate with you? Com no, let me just say this. Communication is very good. It's mm -hmm. very important and very vital in mm -hmm. every kind of relationship because friendship is part of a relationship. But also communication I five kumaanisha ati unanipigia kila siku, kila time. And mm because -hmm. I'm your friend after every five minutes after every one hour. Hi. Uh, friendship in terms of communication happens in this way. Say for example, uh, you were in Canada or you in USA and I'm in Kenya yeah time they are different true but another thing una for understand we are also working towards our goal to achieve what you want to achieve in life and as much as we are busy we want to work on some few things here and there hai manishi ati sasa tuko seko nini kukosa communicate time yenye uko available yeah not after three weeks but at least hata in a day or in a week communicate thrice hai manishi juu ya communicate thrice in a week as you have to because at the end of the day Let's not focus on just friend friend. Yes, we need friends in our lives, but remember at the end of the day you need you. You need to build yourself in terms of your career, your goals, your your future and everything. So, communicate hata kama ni mara tatu kwa wiki. Piga simu, si lazima ati kila saa every hour. Hi my friend. Sasa BST. No, that we are busy man and we are adults. And then I feel like when you tunasema you know your true friend. You just get to a point to realize huyu ni rafiki na huyu hapana kidogo mm. siezi rely on them but the, the, so, the issue is this another thing talking of friendship as it you come apart to 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 ngelele but the problem is this eh, and this issue comes in here mm. she is my friend and we were friends since kitambo mm -hmm. then i'm elevate nimeanza sasa kukuwa influence ama kukuwa ku feel vibaya jua me grow yeah yeah inaanza kuni diminish at sasa Bona alafu unaanza sasa kuona na ringa you are elevate you see you compete exactly. with your friend and you cannot be the same time zone is different just because very la mefika mali anafaa kufika mm -hmm. haimaanisha utafika utafika lakini time yako ungoje mm -hmm. be patient yeah. so don't start com com comparing yourself ama una, una compete na Beryl ati sasa Beryl amenunua gari 
Eh, mimi kesho pia ndo nunua hii gari. Mm, yeah. Sasa Beryl amevaa hivi designer clothes. Tomorrow I'm going to buy a designer perfume. Yeah. You know that that's bad for friendship. Friendship friendship means ku ready ku accept. Kama Beryl ame grow, appreciate her, congratulate her. Wait for your time. Pia wewe utakuwa congratulated. Si yeah. compare na kuanza ku kushinda ume compete na yeye. Yeah. No. Cuz you una that also breeds jealousy. Yeah. Mm. So Beryl, if you cuz madam kwanza you know particularly <laughs> madam to be quite to honest. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. I know there there might be some guys who might be jealous at eh gari yako sijui nyumba ume you're making money. Mm. But men don't usually have this mm. issues sana. I told you you're not complicated. Yeah, men are simple. <laughs> I feel like mna kwanga my brother for like 3 months at ujui ujui. Oh, naweza panda friendship kwa kitu yote as he says. Sisi tunajoe bond. Sisi every small thing inakuanga ka issue. So ladies experience that a lot even with social media. Unaangalia mtu una compete na mtu mwenye hata ujui. You've never met eh au akujui. Amzee kutana hata hivi ujai muona na macho yako. But how do you deal with that? The minute you realize rafiki yako ako in competition with you. Una ama the minute una realize kuna urafiki yangu ana do better and I'm feeling some type of way. How do you personally una decide gadi ndo kwa like no, let me celebrate her wins and then I will get there in time. I feel like I've, I've had it uh, once. I've, I've had it, and it took me long to realize that club for others, your time is coming. Because I felt like we passed through so much, and akangia shulembele angu, and now you feel like everybody. Yeah, maybe then I nearly put a job, but then in anga campus, so yeah, na workplace plan, and they're like, there, my shame, we kuchapa, and I'm like, hey. Kuni mimi niko sawa wapi kwa rafiki. Mm. Why is he or she not a friend? Kunipigeni ulize very look wapi? Mm. Bende kuna kitu fulani imetokea. There's something that you can do. You feel? You yeah. see kuna vitu zinapotea. And if 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 I can just go back to whatever Anthony had said, the yo mambo ya consistency. One thing I know about friendship. Mimi nikisema I look at my friend one week. I give them my lifespan of one week. It's because I know my friends. Najua how tight your schedule is. I know at what time, if I want to talk to somebody, I have friends outside the country. So if I want to talk to you, unajuanga, umineacha na umineya wazi. Me, I'm that type of friend. Nimekubali kwa mka three, kukupigia, kujulia, ukwaje, uko kunendele aje. Utani text, nilikuwa busy. Labda I got held up somewhere. I'll reply to you. I just want at least ukwe hapo. So you see, iyo mambo ya hating on friends, nikitu hiko. It's something that is there. And we, I think at some point, everybody of us are put here. Kuna tuwe nye uya aliniacha, stages in life aliniacha, but you have to accept. Mm -hmm. Angalia, aliniacha wapi hapa. She found this and I couldn't get it. So what do I do? You just accept. Maybe yangu takuja in another way. Yeah, you know, Liza, me I used to ask, bethe, uko, because I'm a somia media and I'm, I'm a media student. So I was like, bethe, uko tu wanafunishuwa nga nini? Eh, okay. Eh, kuna nini uko? Unaso, Oh, so there's a difference between an anchor and a host. There's a try to kulizia. If you have an interest in the same direction, kama e, mwanza kwa mbae gari, amenua Lexus. Eh, like, eh? So, kukanda Lexus gani inaka hivi? Yeah. I feel like we need to appreciate in such a way to not bring out the hate. Can you just show interest? Yeah. And kama we tu melevet, atu kulizi ndo tukushinde. Tuwazika tu tu appreciate at least one of the steps you took. Into so that uh, and that's how we f that's how we build friendship. Yeah. That's if true. you used to read books, nembe beri lamka subu isoma books, but la kushinda on Snapchat, TikTok, chukua ten minutes, read a book, mm -hmm. learn something. Yeah. That is how we live it. See, that is yeah, true. So that's mm -hmm. true friendship. That's true. true. Iyo ni mwenye anakusaidia kukuinua na mwenye mm. akuchini anaku celebrate. Mm. Because either way, timeline mwenye tunasema ni different. Mm. You have to encourage someone in that timeline unam celebrate in that timeline mm -hmm. when your time comes you'll expect to be celebrated mm -hmm. otherwise utasema watu ni mahater mm -hmm. na we mwenyewe utakuwa umesahau labda ulikuwa hater at some point mm -hmm. so i also want to touch on male and female friendships okay cuz unajua sasa barely i mentioned something akasema hiyo ni relationship but then we have people who genuinely their friends yeah. as male and female labda me toka mbali mna bond over maybe something bestie 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 mimi na ongelea jeni i'm not talking about bestie bestie no i'm not talking about bestie bestie i'm not talking about someone who's like a my friend zoniwa genuine male and female friendships because you know sengine kuna kuanga na hiyo ati ati madem na maboys kwa mabeshte Anthony, is that really true? And if you're friends with a with a lady, ah, I'm passing some. I'm going to leave him sorry, son. What are you getting sorry? 
Sasa acha niseme. Yeah. A, a man and a woman is okay to be friends. Mm -hmm. But uh, depends with which kind of friendship you have. Because, well, you know, there can be a million kinds of friendship between men and women. Naza kuwa ni ubeshte ya pesa. Naza kuwa ni ubeshte ya yu ingine. So it depends. Another thing, touching on relationship, I cannot accept my woman or my, my girl to be having a best friend with a, a guy. guy. Why? Yo, why? <laughs> no, I'm supposed why? to be the best friend. Exactly. What do you mean? Actually, yeah. we, should st we have started as, fr as friends. Yeah. Because that is how relationship builds. So why then should you entertain another man if I'm your, uh, if I'm your, I'm your best? Actually, relationship should be I'm your best friend, mm -hmm. but not another man. But the, the issue is, Nini madam, same kama wewe ndio demi yangu. Mm -hmm. Alafu sasa ni kupate uko na rafiki. Uniambie unaje tumetoka mbali hata before ukuje. Na hiyo ni kumaanisha nini sasa? It's okay I'm not saying you break up ama muacha hiyo rafiki yenu, but set boundaries. Yeah. Yeah. Which is important. Hata in that uh, genuine male and female friendship boundaries are uh, should be kwa sababu without boundaries mm -hmm. Unaweza kujanga sleep over mara nyingi sana. Kifaranga itakuliwa. Very. To be a perspective yako. Wewe do you think you can have a friendship with a guy? Will it be a friendship ama itakuwa? Mm, itakuwa bestie bestie. Eh. I feel like I have friendship with male uh, the male gender. Mm -hmm. Niko na magai ni marif tu. Ni beshte. Ni, mm -hmm. ni mtu anaweza pigana mambo ya manzee leo siku imekuwa tu mbaya. Kwa shoulder to lean on eh. あんまりなんかトレイクしてまで。なんかやっぱりそれにもだ。なんかやっぱりそれにもだ。なんかやっぱりそれにもだ。なんかやっぱりそれにもだ。なんかやっぱりそれにもだ。なんかやっぱりそ
it really matters a lot because at times you just need someone just to you just pick the phone and cry yeah and akuzo ko sawa and cut just show up any situation yeah. no matter where you are for me just show up mm. always be there and you see that's very powerful because with the formula that you've given us if you're positive you're consistent you have vulnerability then it's so easy for you to show up mm-hmm. and be like I've, i know her she's mm-hmm. my friend barely beshte angu damu so every time brings us back to what you were saying at the very beginning if you call at 3 am mm-hmm. and you're crying and it's kama ni pal na afika i can get there i should make the effort because i know that you're genuinely going through something you're not it's out of your character to call at 3 mm-hmm. uko unapitia hivyo so that is it's very important you may sum up <laughs> you may bring back to the the yes. uh, the introduction so timothy we have a few more comments you can pull that up before we wrap the show up but friendships it's it, it takes a lot but mm-hmm. i like the way your formula really summarized this mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so uh, this uh, this is still facebook i believe spice boy says uh, Wow, you both look amazing. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. All of us look amazing. Thank, Thank you. Nico Daki. Pashe Fix says a true friend sticks on his lane as, as a, a friend. friend. Yeah. yeah, that's true because that shows respect. Emma D Boy K says negative mind is a key to depression. Let's all stay positive. That's good. That's very good. I think that is a good <laughs> note yeah. to even finish mm-hmm. the conversation on. Yeah. So, uh, I think that's it for today. We've had a very interesting conversation mm. and um I hope you've gotten something from this. If you haven't, just be consistent be consistent in your friendships and show up for your friendships. Whatever you expect from them is what you should be willing to offer. That is it for today. Thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. This has been the Power Talk show. A repeat of this show will air tomorrow between 1 and 2 p.m. and we'll also have this on YouTube. So tune in again next week we'll have another interesting conversation for you. Thank you so much and have a lovely evening. Why 254? Imagine.